Let's talk about BMW's oil change interval. BMW used to recommend going 15,000 miles or 24 months between oil changes. And remember, some of these cars were already known for having bad rod bearings. So bad rod bearings and 15,000 mile oil changes doesn't seem like a good combination. But then they changed it to 10,000 miles or 12 months for cars 2014 or newer. Uh, apparently those engines are more complex and require more frequent oil changes. Now if you're like me you saw these numbers and thought something doesn't seem right. Quick disclaimer, I'm not a mechanic but I did talk to an experienced BMW mechanic and I asked him a lot of questions on this topic. I also read a bunch of articles and some horror stories relating to oil changes and blown engines. So I'm basically just going to repeat what I learned from them. I'm not here to tell you how to maintain your car. If you want to do 15,000 mile oil changes, go for it. If you want to do 3,000 mile oil changes, go for it. I did oil changes every 5 to 6,000 miles with synthetic oil with every car that I owned before buying this 335i. And I never had any trouble. The old oil always looked fine when I drained it. But then I bought a BMW and this was the first car that I ever bought from the dealer and it came with the service package which means BMW would take care of all my maintenance until a certain mileage and uh, this is when I learned about their 10,000 mile oil change intervals remember your warranty will probably run out before you get rod knock most cars just have the standard for your 50,000 mile warranty there are so many different opinions when it comes to oil changes here are some of the main ones I've seen do your oil changes every 3,000 miles. Do your oil changes around 5 to 6,000 miles, which is what I did on my previous cars. And uh, doing your oil changes every 10,000 miles on modern cars is okay as long as you're using synthetic oil, which is what's been done to my current car by BMW. But I haven't really seen anyone say that 15,000 or more miles between oil changes is fine. So I talked to a mechanic who owns a German car and owns a shop that works on German cars and he immediately said that the original BMW 15,000 mile oil change interval is a bad idea. But he also said that the 3,000 mile oil change interval used to make sense with conventional oil but with modern synthetic oil, uh, the synthetic oil has a much longer life so the 3,000 mile oil change is really not necessary. So it seems like 3,000 mile oil changes aren't needed unless you have an older car or if you track your car a lot. And uh, even the California government website says not to do 3,000 mile oil changes because people suck at disposing their used oil. They uh, leave it in random places or they dump it in sewers. So the 3,000 mile oil change just causes a lot of unnecessary pollution. So for a modern car like mine that uses synthetic, should I do 10,000 miles or 5,000 miles? Well, according to my mechanic and many other car related sources, it really depends on where I drive the car, how I drive the car, how many heating and cooling cycles it goes through, uh, am I putting mostly city miles on it or mostly highway miles on it? City will obviously wear things out faster. The mechanic also mentioned that the fact that my car holds about 7 quarts of oil while most cars hold like 5 quarts is going to make a difference. There will be more oil being circulated in the BMW and that will also be a factor in the oil change intervals. Blackstone Labs analyzes used oil to get a reading on engine health. You can send your oil there for $30 and uh, they will see if there's anything in it that shouldn't be there. Just as important as doing oil changes on time is letting oil warm up properly. While I think BMW kind of screwed us on the 15,000 mile oil change interval, one place that didn't screw us is with the oil temp gauge. Many cars use a coolant temp gauge which doesn't take a very long time to come up to temp, but my car shows the oil temp not coolant temp. I always drive the car in eco mode and try my best to keep the RPMs really low until that gauge is at about 165 or higher. Uh, it takes nearly 10 minutes to warm up but it's worth it. Doing frequent oil changes but not warming your car up properly before beating on it is a great way to damage your engine. After seeing BMW's oil change interval, talking to a mechanic and just reading through different articles, I think I'm just going to keep doing my 5 to 6,000 mile oil changes. 
if I had a really high mileage car, uh, an old car, or a car that I just don't drive very often, then I'd probably do the 3,000 mile changes. Although if damage has already been done to an engine, increasing the oil change frequency won't fix it. I wish that's how life worked. FCP Euro sells oil change kits for my car. You can go with the OEM or Liquamoly. Whatever interval you decide to follow, just make sure you use the correct oil and always warm your car up properly. And while we may not agree on the oil change interval, one thing everyone knows for sure is that you should always change your blinker fluid at 42,069 miles or you're going to run into some serious issues. But anyways, thank you for watching. Hit like, leave a comment, subscribe, all that. Uh -huh.